How's it going, everybody? Andy McCall from the Kansas City Star here at Camden Yards where the Royals knocked off the Orioles 14-6. to uh, It was the Royals' second win in their last eight games. Um, they still may lose ground on the, uh, the Blue Jays today in the race for home field advantage as the Blue Jays won the first half of a doubleheader against the Yankees. And as of right now, I think they're up three runs in the nightcap. But it's raining, so who knows. Anyway, um, it was a good win for the Royals, and the big hero of the day was Mike Boustakis, who had uh, set a franchise record with nine RBI guys in one game. All of them came um, after the sixth inning. Um, Moustakis had a two-run single in the sixth. He hit a grand slam in the seventh, and in the ninth, just for fun, he added a three-run homer. Um, he made a slight mechanical adjustment with uh, Dale Swaim that uh, paid big dividends, so the Royals should hope that he sticks with it. Um, you know, the, the, there wasn't much panic within the Royals clubhouse coming into today. Um, they knew, obviously, they're a very good, very good team. They knew that they, you know, still are going to make the playoffs almost assuredly, so they're not particularly worried. But they hadn't been playing great baseball, and so it was nice to you know have a have a big win, have the offense break out, and so they were able to celebrate that afterwards. Um, Mustakis played great. Uh, you're not even sure it was okay. Uh, he went five and two thirds and gave up four runs. He left the bases loaded in the sixth. Um, when he left. Ryan Madsen came in and had a big strikeout of Chris Davis through a wicked changeup to get through it, and then after that, Moustakas, you know, drove in uh, seven more runs, and so that's kind of uh, why the outcome was so skewed. Um, it, but you can uh, read all about this in the pages of the Kansas City Star and KansasCity.com, and on our True Blue app. Have a good night.